See, Drake, um, he wears sweaters made out of the downy bear. So I feel like he wouldn't make it long in a Walker-led right. universe because I feel like they would pull him down because he'd be up there being like, don't you guys want to dance to some sad music about a girl I saw three times? Yeah. And then they're like, oh, oh. Hey guys, welcome to Happy Hour. I'm your host, Lindsay Ames. And today I am joined by Henry Zabrowski from the last podcast on the left and your pretty face is going to hell. Very excited to have you here. From the Staten Island Zabrowski's. From the Staten Island Zabrowski's. Now, Henry, before we get into everything that's good Walking Dead, mm. I'd love to talk about this cocktail that I made. It's called the Rick. You want to know why? Yeah. It's basically like the embodiment of Rick in a glass. It's Johnny Walker, black label. It's soda. It's a little bit of orange bitters. I also smoked a little bit of rosemary, and I hit a little bit of an orange peel just to make a kiss of flavor. That's very tasty. Thank you. So Rick says to Negan, when they're just like in that jail cell, no matter what, it's human nature to come together. Do you believe that? The great Ronald Reagan, uh, what he said was that he, when he was speaking with Gorbachev, is that he felt that the only thing that could bring all of society together was something like an alien invasion. I do think that if you look at instead Black Friday sales, you see more of what will happen when you get a lot of humans together. I feel like you see so much of the push and pull throughout the series of people being brought together and then definitely pushed apart. Do you think in let's say a Walker apocalypse that you would be somebody that unifies people or you're gonna be like, let's take it down. You get me the big walkie talkie mm -hmm. where I'm talking to the forces mm -hmm. up in a penthouse that's been completely burnt out. As a benevolent despot of the new world, I would listen and handle everybody's problems in a way that yes, it would seem sort of heavy handed as a dictator up top, but the, I would slowly give it back to society eventually once the walker problem has been handled and subsided yes and i've got my land picked out and the people in my party all have their their sanctions of land picked out and then we pick one central area where we'll put people and then that'll be then it'll be good wait what is the oh the central area is people would live there right right but they would be well accepted until we keep pushing the walkers out because the idea is you build a cordon area get all the walkers out yep. everybody lives in baltimore Push him out, push him out, push him out. Then slowly move the wall, right? Now we got a DC, we'll get back to DC. We right. see what they've done to Abraham Lincoln. We cry in a poignant moment because you know the walkers will have be like, oh. Would you accept people from the opposite group into your group? Well, Rick would because Rick's like a good guy, but I would have more fun as Negan. And honestly, it'd be kind of fun to have him in the group. And after a while, like you got to test him. You get a brown paper bag. Okay. Right, and you'd be like, "What's in this bag?" And they'd be like, "Well, no, boss, well, it wasn't big." Just Where's like, that accent from? That's deep, deep south. Because when you go down there, there's some parts. Do you know that there's parts of Appalachia? Yes. That are, have been untouched by modern hands, and they sing songs from the Revolutionary days. I'm actually not surprised about that because I did see that movie with Burt Reynolds. And all of their accents are like, yeah. "Me go down, we go down to the woods wheel." when we go to get making taters because it's a mixture of thousands of years. I'm not sure how old I know because you sounded is. kind of Australian for a second, a little touch of Irish. Uh, uh, maybe there was some pig Latin in there. It's a melting pot. Yeah, it was. That's what makes this country beautiful. Yeah. Because all of, we are allowed to sound like that. Yeah. Is that we should have one of those in every television but, show. Right. Where they go, oh, I don't know what you see, girl. Yeah, my children got any other y'all cooking, right? Right, and whatever that is. Like, I don't know what that accent is, but they should be allowed to be on our television show. Yeah, but so, but yes. okay, I want to know your test. So Negan has the bag, and he's just like, bitch, you can't guess what's in my bag. And he's like, oh, I want you to look cool, man. Negan, I feel like a little cool, and we can be in bed because of friends. He's like, I don't care what you're saying, I don't understand a word you're saying. You know, you open it, he's like, it looks like there's an apple in it, and he goes, oh, thing, it's an apple. And he takes it out to the grenade, and he's just like, eat the <laughs> apple. Yeah. And he's like, what? You said it's not an apple. It's all different layers and layers and layers. I, I just wonder if really, when push comes to shove in that situation, are you going to be uh, really evil? I just don't feel like you're so evil. Depends on what's on the line. True. It depends on what I gotta do and how many people are left. Like, okay, so let's Listen, say- No, 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 okay. Okay, okay, okay. Is it better to do a bad deed than name? of keeping the spark of humanity alive? 
Or is it uh, you break your moral code no matter what? Are you forever damned to spin on this rock until there's no life left? Me? I'm getting all the shotguns I can get. If you couldn't tell, we had so much fun here today. Yeah. And if you are interested in making the cocktail, it is in the description below. And thank you to Johnny Walker for this bottle of Black Label to make our cocktail with. And Henry, if people want to find you. Oh, you can find me at Henry Loves You on Twitter. And for last podcast on the left, at LP on the left. Uh, and for your pretty face going to hell, at your pretty face. <laughs> this is great. This is great. There's I mean, so many it. ways yeah. to find me. Yeah. And if you do want to find me also, uh, please find me at Lindsay Ames on Instagram, Twitter, YouTube. See you next time.